Welcome to a unique video and some unique mods. Today we're going to be talking about the mods that have been standing out in their own special way on the workshop. So grab yourself some snacks, take a seat, and prepare to add mods to your game. Have you ever thought it was strange your pawns know everything about a world they just crashed onto? Have you ever wanted to change that? Now you can with the RimWorld Exploration mod. The world as you know it has been hidden from view. You're going to need to go out and explore to discover other factions and see what this bountiful planet has in store. There are a few unique bits of world travel. It's harder to see you through past mountains and you move slower on rivers. But wait, there's more. Traveling isn't the only way to discover the world. Some pawns will drop mats that will reveal locations. In addition, in addition to all this, the relationships you make with other factions have a new perk. They will share the world map info they have with you. Now I'm sure you are already wondering this already, but this mod does indeed have compatibility with Rimwar. You can now unwittingly walk into war zones during your travels, and it will be that much more difficult to hunt down your greatest foes. This mod hit the workshop less than a month ago at time of writing and is still feeling fresh. Be sure to check it out and be sure to stay till the end. This next mod has made some interesting changes to the dynamic of your natural world. River is used to be these boring streams that at best slowed down raiders and sped up decomposition, but no longer. They have been given greater purpose with Some Things Float mod. The Some Things Float mod does what you think it does, and more. Objects in the river will now float downstream and even off the map. What a great way to get rid of stuff. What's more, sometimes things will enter the map via the stream. I wonder what you might find. Ever thought combat extended or Yayo's combat was getting old? There's a new contender for the combat mod throne. Pawns are now gonna John Wick each other in combat. With improved reaction time, they will avoid line of sight in combat choosing the safest of routes to get close to your pawns. They will be divided into groups when attacking, each with their own goals and targets, and everyone will be able to sap if they need to. This is a threat you are not prepared for, or are you? Because your pawns are smarter now too. Stealth, go sniper elite and take out enemies at camps one by one, and try not to raise the alarm. All of that combined, this mod also has optional fog of war. Your battles are going to be edge of your seat nail biting fun. Pair this with Rimworld Expert mode for a totally new RimWorld experience. Ever thought roofs in RimWorld were kinda an underutilized thing? With the expanded roofing, you can have glass ceilings, solar roofs, and thick roofs, which do require some maintenance, but they're pretty good. It's a small mod, but it's also a great addition to the game. Be sure to check it out. This next one is a bit of a QLL mod. Auto cut stumps does exactly what it says. Pawns will automatically cut stumps after chopping trees. This can help get your clear cutting done faster or just keep the map looking cleaner. Removing stumps is helpful as well because guess it or not, it counts as low cover. Don't give those raiders anywhere to hide. Roads of the Rim has gotten a continuation and added railroads. Now you can build an industrious empire built on trade, moving resources and people great distances in a short amount of time. This mod, like the others, has got me hyped for some unique playthroughs. Be sure to check it out. Have you ever thought it was lame that your tribal Stark colony would carry its debuffs long into the space age with the tech level progression mod? This is no longer a concern. The game will change your colony's tech level based on what parts of the research tree you completed. A small but impactful mod, very tasteful, will be using in the future. All right, gotta plug myself in this video. The Everyone Can Work mod will allow you to put anyone that can walk to work. This is a great addition to a tribal run or lower tech run where all working bodies are needed to sustain the colony. Give it a try and tell me what you think. Thanks, Canon, for helping me get this out there. Are you the type to grind wealth management in your colony? The visible raid points might help you get a better picture of how fast the raids coming at you are strengthening. Giving an indicator on the raid card, noting the raid points value of each raid. A nice QLL mod for sure. Portraits of the Rim is a new and very unique mod to hit the workshop that generates portraits for the characters you select in-game from colonists to visitors and quest givers. This mod is great and a unique addition to your game that can spice things up. Give it a try. This next one, or I guess two, have to do with throwables. The throw over wall mod allows you to lob a flaming beer and grenades over walls at your enemies from the safety of your home. Pair this mod with the throw them continue to keep your pawns well equipped and have easy access to your tools of death. Excellent. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. I'd like to thank all my awesome patrons that keep this channel on its feet. Feel free to support us and get early access to videos like this one. See you guys in the next one.